in his continuing series on Lord Allen introduces us to a leading tertiary institution in China that is changing the game for STEM-based studies. Designed to foster cohesive learning across the country, this center, a kind of academic city, has attracted students both locally and abroad since 2020. Across the more than seven square mile campus exists a buffet of top-notch satellite universities, including the University of Glasgow, the University of Electronic Science and Technology of China, the Communication University of China, and Coventry University. With the current student population of just over 2,000, the goal is to expand to around 30,000 students by 2035. The term Sino-Foreign Corporation describes the environment of international studies done within China through collaboration and cooperation, with international schools essentially creating a multi-leveled learning center. While much of the facility remains under construction, its most active space is its 21st century library. It is the largest library per capita in China. This is the waterfall of books. So we have digital, we have a digital uh, uh, database like this of more than 100,000 100, books. We have a pass like this. You can just choose, for example, uh, multiple books you, you like. And you can walk through this passage, and the books are borrowed. You can borrow like multiple, multiple books at once, and when you return them, you can return them anywhere in the book, on the bookshelf, because uh, each book has a has a chip inside. Along with Lian International Education Pilot Zone has reached the end of Phase 1. Phase 2 promises to take Chinese students to the next level. Reporting from Dad and Kun, Hanan for the Bahamas Tonight, I'm Lloyd Allen. Hi there, I'm Corval Pyfrom. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment and subscribe for all things ZNS.